It is a beautiful day. Thank you for joining me. Once again, for a lot of you that have subscribed, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. And I want to do a lot of these videos for you on personal development, on entrepreneurship, on you know real estate. I want to bring you value. And if you're just joining me, if you're just discovering me, uh, I do a lot of these videos. And I would encourage you to subscribe. Uh, hit the bell so you're notified the next time I do a video. And all I do is I want to bring you value. I mean, I'm in a, I want to be in a position of service to you and your family and your goals. And uh, I'm happy that you're here. If you find value in this video or any of the other videos that I've done, simply you know, share it with all your friends on all your social media platforms and let's spread the word. Um, Return on investment on COVID-19. That is a video that I did uh, about a month ago and it's had hundreds and hundreds of views and a lot of people resonated with it. But uh, one thing that uh, people were asking me about is Alfonso. You know, at that time, I had lost about 12 pounds or what have you. And, uh, you know, people are like, Alfonso, how, how did you lose all that weight? Like, what's your secret? Now, there's a video that I did a long time ago that it, uh, I, I can probably even put it in the links here, but you know, I'm gonna actually go through my process, you know, and uh, in fact, in the last 20 days, I've lost 20 pounds. I've lost 20 pounds in the last 20 days. And so I'm excited and I'm not surprised because I've done it many times before. And there's something very specific that I do that I wanna share with you in this video. But before I go there, it's important that you understand I am not a health expert. I am not uh, certified in fitness and wellness. I am simply someone that's just gonna share uh, their experience with you. I'm gonna share my experience with you. I have a very specific body type and uh, exercise doesn't really work for me uh, in the way that you think. And, and I'm sure there's gonna be conflicting um, approaches. And so if you do have something that is different, you know what? Write it in the comments below. I'm open to, to exploring all kinds of different things. Also, if you already are trying something, you, I, I suggest that you stick with that, whatever that is. Uh, I see people just jumping from idea to idea, the Hollywood diet, the, the, the peach juice diet, the, the LA diet, all kinds of weird things. Okay. And so this is a way for you to lose weight quickly without dieting or exercise. If that is something that resonates with you, uh, you know, you could try it. Now, where did this uh, come from? Well, I used to travel a lot and I've been doing this for about 20 years. And uh, I used to travel a lot to Asia, uh, in particular China. And I remember I asked a simple question, you know, you ask the right question, you get the right answer, right? And I, asked, I kept asking the question to myself, you know, um, how can I lose weight without dieting or exercise? You know, the reason I, I, I asked that question is every time I would exercise a lot, I would tend to eat a lot and I would, the reverse would, would happen. I would gain weight. And so I realized for my body type, um, it's hard for me to lose weight with exercise. Now, exercise is important. Absolutely. Exercise is important for your health. Exercise is important for energy, having a, a, you, know, a, 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 you know, good blood flow through your body, great blood pressure, you know, burning calories and whatnot, but it's not good for me for weight loss. And so then I started to, 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 to notice uh, Chinese people, and this is from my observation, okay, this is only my opinion, watching uh, Asian people, and I, I kind of saw all of their habits. They don't eat, right? I mean, a lot of the foods that they have is very greasy. Uh, they don't exercise much. In fact, uh, you know, uh, they don't exercise at all, the ones that I saw, right? I'm sure there's some that, that, that exercise. But the, when, when I was in China, and I've been to China, you know, uh, I would say hundreds of times, um, that's from a past life, uh, I used to be in the textile business uh, back, you know, 24, 20 years ago. And uh, as a result, I ended up traveling to China uh, to, to source my goods. So I ended up spending a lot of time there. And I asked that question, like, you know, what are they doing that, that I could do? And, you know, because 
when you look at Asian people, generally speaking, they're slim, right? And they don't exercise and they don't diet. And so I started to question, question, question. And I came up with uh, the solution after trying it uh, many different times. The key to losing weight quickly without dieting or exercise. How to lose 20 pounds in 20 days. And uh, if you go back to my video on, on the return on investment on the COVID-19 situation, uh, you'll see that uh, my goal is 30 pounds, so I'm, temp I'm, I'm about 10 pounds away. I have no doubt in my mind that I'll be able to lose 10 pounds in the next, uh, probably the next 10 days or, or uh, maybe even 12 or 15 days. At the end of the day, it doesn't really matter, right? But the key, my friends, drum roll, is water. Water. Human beings are made up of 80% water. When we're born, we're actually, uh, you know, more close to 90%, right? Water is the most important thing for weight loss. Now, not just water, it's how you use it. And I learned this, uh, I learned this from Asians. Mmm, I ah, love me some water. Water is the key to your weight loss. And so let me, let me, and it's not just the water, it's how you use it. Number one, I want to, I'm going to put some things up here and I just want you guys to understand that this is just my perspective. There's many different approaches. If you have a conflicting approach, there's no problem with that. If something's working for you, keep on doing it. Okay, I'm just sharing with you how I lost 20 pounds in 20 days using water without any dieting or uh, exercise. So if this resonates with you, share it, use it, whatever you want to do with it. And if you know what, if you have a different approach or if you can, you know, if you can take something from it, even better write comment below i want to know how you are losing weight what you're doing there's a lot of different approaches uh but the most important is that you stick to something right so number one the key is going to be water 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 now there's uh, a lot of conflict uh, uh a lot of uh conflicting opinions on this right people talk about the the quality of the water Right? So I don't want to talk about you know, mineral water and, and the quality of the water. I'm just going to say water because I've just been using, and I'm, I'm going to tell you, some people might cringe to this, but I've been using tap water. Right? Um, I do believe there's, there's values in the mineral waters and whatnot and all the, 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 the sterilized type of water, but um, water is important. Right? Now, if I was living in a in a developing country where the water was not, uh, you know, you were not able to drink the water, then of course I, I would have a very different opinion. But in this case, in Canada, the water is drinkable. And so I'm using tap water. It doesn't, I mean, I don't think there's a, I mean, there, obviously there's, there's more benefits from, uh, you know, the better the quality of the water and whatnot. And we can, that's a separate uh, conversation. Now, here's the first thing. Number one is the temperature of the water. I, 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 okay, so here's, a lot of people are going to disagree, but warm or hot. And I realized this in, when I was in China. Everybody in China drinks hot water. Everybody. It could be 40 degrees uh, Celsius outside. And, you know, if you're sweating, you're sweating. And then someone will hand you a... Uh, nice hot glass of water right and so hot water i think is one of the reasons why water is so effective you see when you and this is tea here tea water and if you watch uh, if you observe asian people it, it's all about hot hot tea hot water hot soup hot liquids look at this mm. this is my tea right here i got my tea my water and so um, I want to I want to say that warm or hot water is the key. Perfect example. 
when you wake up in the morning, you have your hot coffee, what is the first thing that you want to do? You want to go to the bathroom. You see, hot water dissolves everything inside of you and it passes through. Again, my friends, please, 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 don't shoot the messenger. This has worked for me. This is the what I think, my opinion. If you have a different opposing or approach, different approach, uh, because I know that some people out there think cold water is the best. Uh, to me, it's just... You know, it's in my mind, right? So I, I think anything cold will, you know, you know, conserve, you know, like when you put things in a fridge uh, and I think hot will dissolve, okay? But that's just in my mind. But I can, when I drink hot water, I can almost see, you know, every, going, it, going through, it's going right through my body and it's dissolving everything and it's coming out the other side. And as you know, being able to clean out is the best thing that you can do. So the temperature, I never drink any cold water. Um, Room temperature, warm or hot, the hotter the better, hot teas, uh, things like that, right? Soups and things like that. Okay, so here's the next thing. The very first thing in the morning that you want to do is drink water. You want to drink water maybe an hour to an hour and a half uh, before, before, before eating before eating in the morning, okay? So, um, and this is, there's, there's, there, this has actually been proven scientifically, okay? So you can go, go, to, uh, go on Google, search uh, drinking water first thing in the morning. What I do is I drink e either like a half a liter or a liter of water every single morning and I don't eat for an hour and a half. Think about it. You, when you are sleeping through the night, you are, your body's in fasting mode, okay? A breakfast is to break the fast. If you, but in, a, in at the very beginning, you're going to be hungry in the morning. Most people, the first thing they do is, uh, you know, they eat. But what you should do is drink a liter of water, half a liter or a liter of water, uh, an hour and a half to an, an hour to an hour and a half before you sleep. Now, what this does is this speeds up your metabolism by 45%. This is not me saying that you can go Google this. Uh, many, many reports have been done on this, and this is exactly the habits of people in Asia, right? The very first thing they do is they drink hot or warm water in the morning an hour to an hour and a half before they, before they, they, they eat, they eat breakfast. Now, what does this do? Your body now, anything you eat throughout that day, your body will automatically burn it 45% faster. Meaning, you know, your body goes to work for you if you just do this one thing with water, right? This is incredible. 45% increase in your metabolism. And so that is, to me, that's like giving me an edge, right? So I can wait the hour, hour and a half before I eat. And so if you do this, and by the way, you have to make it into a habit. I'm going to get into some of those, you know, how you're going to do that. But, you know, water, one and a half hours before, before you eat, that's the best thing you can do. Here's the last thing. If, we, if it's true that our bodies are made up of, you know, 80% water, we, that means we are water. A lot of the times, you know, people talk about cravings. People talk about, you know, being hungry. Um, and you tend to overeat in these cases. So this is why dieting doesn't work. If you diet, um, you're gonna have you, you at some point you're gonna break down and you're gonna get hungry. And you know I just love uh, certain foods, a little bit of cheese, a little bit of uh, of um, you know meat and things like that. So um, by the way, I don't want to get into the vegan and non-vegan uh, conversation here. It's simply about weight loss, fast without dieting, and uh, break, uh, and exercise. So. Uh, the last thing I said, you want to drink water all day. You want to drink water all day. You see, what happens is a lot of the times, you're, if you don't drink enough water, and I'm going to say all the water should be warm, uh, if you don't drink enough water throughout the day, your mind confuses that with hunger. And so when you have those cravings, you think you're hungry, but you're really just dehydrated, okay? And so uh, to, to speed up this, and by the way, this works, 
and it's worked for me for years and years and years. But if you want to speed it up, I would say eliminate alcohol. So I haven't drank alcohol for about uh, 20 days. And so the reason I haven't drank any alcohol is because alcohol kind of dehydrates you and you want to be hydrated, right? You want to, I drink water throughout the day, all day long. So when it comes to my meals, hold on. Mmm, good water. So I drink water all day long. So when it comes to my meals, I can have a regular meal. Now, I am going to uh, I am going to be very conscious of what I eat. I'm going to have some vegetables, maybe I have a little, you know, maybe you know some some sauce, uh, um, salad dressing, what have you, uh, some little chicken, little meat, right? I'm going to be conscious, but it's not really a diet, right? It's a really a lifestyle change and what happens is I don't eat as much because I am, my body is satisfied throughout the day. Drinking water, drinking water, drinking water, drinking water. Last thing, before you go to bed, drink water, right? So make sure the water is hot. Make sure you are drinking water first thing in the morning to speed up that metabolism. And then now uh, go ahead and drink water all day long and make sure it's hot and warm. Uh, and have tea. Tea is uh, so good for you. Hold on. Mmm, love my tea, love my tea. Now, there's other things that go into this, right? So this is, if you do this, you're definitely going to see results. But how do you speed it up? One, I said, uh, you want to leave the alcohol behind a little bit. I mean, a lot of calories and alcohol also it dehydrates your body. So how do you achieve anything? You can go back uh, to that video, how to get a return on investment in the COVID-19 situation. Uh, we talk about the what, what is it that you want, who is the person you need to become and become that person now. The what in this case is very simple. I wanted to lose 30 pounds uh, in the next what, you know, month or so. So, number one, I made a public display. I told everyone that I was going to do it. And this is important that you follow, you know, you, might ha you, you have to declare it to the world. What I suggest is you create a contract with yourself. Now, I don't want you to get stuck to a, a goal because what matters is how you feel. When I put, when I put on my, this shirt, for example, this morning, and it felt nice, you know, this, this, uh, this blazer, you know, my, 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 uh, my clothes are feeling nice. I feel like I have energy in the mornings. Uh, I go for walks. And so I want to make sure that you understand that, uh, you know, it's not so much about the goal. The goal is a target, but, you know, don't get stuck to the goal. You know, focus more on how you feel. I make, I make, a, I make a public display. Um, you want to find someone that you can do this with. This is important because you want to be able to, you know, help each other out on this. Um, competition is good, right? So every day I'm almost competing, uh, competing with myself. So every day... I have a chart where I'm writing down all the progress, how I feel, and uh, uh, you know the weight that I'm losing every single day. Now, I don't want if you don't lose weight on a particular day, don't get discouraged. What happens is, you know, you might lose a lot at the very beginning, and then you kind of stabilize because your body gets used to that particular weight, and then it starts to drop gradually. You know, sometimes I was just, I've been the same weight for you know three days in a row. So don't get discouraged, right? Um, here it is. Uh, when you do lose weight, find a way to celebrate, right? Find some way of you know it's like whoa, you know, get excited about you know even a a, a, a half a pound. That is something to be excited about. And then, of course, you know, follow that momentum. It can continue to, to, to roll with it. Uh, here, there's power in routines. Now, um, I go, I'm going to bed at, at the same time every single day. I'm waking up at the same time. Uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner are exactly at the same time. I have a little snack, maybe an apple, a couple almonds, like, uh, you know, something like that. So, you know, by the time I get to dinner time and I'm having dinner around 5.30 to 6 and I'm going to bed around uh, 10, 10.30. And so, you know, pretty much by 6, that's the last meal I'm going to eat and I drink water. And so uh, those routines are going to be uh, important because if you don't have a routine, a set routine, 
um, it becomes difficult because your body is doesn't know what's coming. So it's important if you want to lose weight, you want to sleep at the same exact time every day and wake up at the exact same time and you want to uh, eat at the exact same time every single day. You want to snack at the exact same time and remember, water is the core to all of this and you guys are going to be successful. And here's the last one. You can't see it there. But the last one is the why. Why are you doing this? Why is this important to you? Why do you want to lose this weight? Uh, is it, uh, you know, for your family because you want to be healthy? Now, once you lose the weight, uh, I suggest that, yes, you know, you continue the exercise because you want to maintain, right? There's going to, it's hard to, once you lose all the weight, you, you, you can't just stop. You know, this is not a diet. This, is a, this, this should be a lifestyle change, right? Because you should make water uh, a huge part of your life for your entire life, not just for uh, trying to lose weight. So when you go back, of course, you're gonna exercise. Uh, here's another thing, my friends. Instead of exercising, after uh, uh, every meal, I go for a, a 10 to 15 minute walk, okay? Uh, that keeps the blood uh, flowing throughout my body, and that's also important. My friends, if you enjoyed this, if this is something that you, you enjoyed, please, 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 please share it with your friends. Uh, talk about it. If you have, a, you know, something to add or if you try it and you have results, you know, uh, write it in the comment below. I, I really want to hear your perspective and what you're doing uh, to, to get healthier so you can have that money, uh, that um, uh, uh, body, mind, uh, spirit uh, experience, you know, so it's like it's all uh, connected. If you feel better about yourself, you can have confidence. You're, then you're going to have a return on investment on your business, your real estate, whatever it is that you're doing. If you enjoyed these videos, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell to be notified the next time I do a video. You guys, uh, you know, Alfonso loves you. I do love you. I want to see you guys uh, succeed. And we'll see you all at the top.